Justice for Moody! Oh, you model father! Where are we going? The old temple in the Wildwoods. Why? It'll be easier to explain once we're there. You know, didn't say anything else while you were outside. Yeah. He said he doesn't care about Jotunheim anymore. That the Giants can keep their secrets. He's averted Ragnarok his own way. You think he knows all the Giants are dead? I'm more concerned <laughs> that it no longer matters to him. What's he up to? What happened here? So close to home. Almost to the bridge. Oh, yes, the bridge gave out. Gonna need another path to the temple. Why did you come out this way alone, lad? I had dreams calling me here. Dreams? Whoa, that one's still alive. You see something down there? That. Something strong and dangerous. Be on guard. Oh, yeah. Be Whatever it is, it works fast. <laughs> Wasn't me. Remember when I said there was someone who might help us get answers about the giants and Loki? You mean Tyr? The old god of war in these lands, who is dead. Well, for a dead man, Odin seemed pretty keen on seeing he wasn't found. Right? He knows Tyr could unite the realms against him. Plus, Tyr was the giant's greatest ally. So... Enough. Still putting up offering soda. I don't think he cares. wasn't in the way last time I came. Like I was saying, Tyr was an ally to the giant. So he'd be on our side if we find him. And if anyone might know who I'm supposed to be, it's him. If he's out there, we gotta find him. How can we not? Those are many ifs, Atreus. Do you know? You'll see soon. Imagine what the lads found, but he says he has evidence. We've come this far. Let's see it. Many dead here. We should keep him. Too late. Father, use your blade. Burn that. Four Raiders, are you left? <laughs> Got him! 
Nice how Fimble Winter wore down all the helpful magic we acquired. Yet somehow new terrors only flourish. As if on cue. <laughs> 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 has gotten rather good at that. <sighs> Yet another grizzly. <laughs> 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 I've seen my share of bloodshed, but this is an awful lot for one morning. Oh, no. Brother! Oh. Oh. On your guard, brother! Brother, I think we found our predator! Nista! The raiders torn out and barging in, and now stalkers praying in our woods. This is no safe haven anymore. Father, the shield Mom gave you. Thor damaged it, but now. Perhaps the dwarves could take a look at it. Perhaps later. 
Come on, we can get in this way. Why are we here, Atreus? Okay. You remember all those shrines we found, telling the stories of giants? How the panel on the left would be their origin, and the panel on the right would be their fate? Yes. We found many. I have seen them. Well, there's more to them than we realized. Well, the collapsed pillar is new, but the shrine is just on the other side. <laughs> <laughs> There we go. Come on. You watching? new. Come on. Atreus, wait! Yeah, I don't think he's waiting. What is this, lad? Where are we? Somewhere only giants were meant to see. These shrines tell their stories to the world. But it turns out the real stories, the secret stories, those they kept here, inside. You remember the story of Skull and Hati, the wolf giants? Odin captured them because he thinks it'll help him control when Ragnarok starts. I remember. But that's not the whole story. See, this shows the giants setting Skull and Hati free. They're free. Is this the past or the future? Depends when you're looking at it. Spoken like a giant. See? The wolves are safe. Somewhere in Vanahar. Not the first place Odin would look, I suppose. There they are. Chasing the sun and moon. Old habits. Until, look, the moon gets stolen. Somehow. Atreus. See? Hati's got nothing to chase. And they say celestial theft is a victimless crime. Not totally sure who this is, but someone comes along and rescues the moon. And then the moon blocks out the sun. A total eclipse? I haven't seen one of those in a hundred winters. But then they chase an arrow, and things go back to normal. What does any of this have to do with... We're coming to that. Look, here's Ragnarok. Do you see who's leading the armies against Odin? That's Tyr. If he's gonna be around at Ragnarok, that means he's gotta be alive. Right? Mimir, can this be? Odin told me he killed Tyr, and he trusted me at the time, or so I thought. What if he didn't kill him? What if he's just had him locked up somewhere all this time? We are back to ifs. Enough. Wait. We are going home. Wait! I have one more thing to show you. It's just out here. What is this? Everything I found. Well, almost everything. That's giant craftsmanship. You've been to Jotunheim again? No, I found it in one of the other shrines. Other shrines? How many have you visited? I... well... all of them? All the ones I could still get to in Midgard anyway. I don't know what it is. But it's important. Just like all this. When I was inside one of the shrines, I saw an image of Tyr imprisoned. But I couldn't tell where. There are hints inside the other shrines. 
They mention black smoke and the bleeding earth. But we can never figure out exactly... We. Yeah, Sindri's been helping me. Look, I talked him into it. It, it wasn't his idea. I just needed someone to watch my back. Black smoke. Bleeding earth. Could the prison be in Muspelheim? Unlikely. Odin's got no presence to speak of in the primordial realms. But the bleeding earth? Sounds like a mine, aye. Uh, the realm of the dwarves, perhaps. Svartalfheim, that's a good bet. Their minds did burst black smoke, and Odin's had his thumb on the dwarves for a very long time. That's it then. Tears in Svartalfheim somewhere, imprisoned in a mine. So, what now? How do you have us getting to Svartalfheim? You know Odin's had all travel between realms locked up tight. Sindri said he had an idea or two about that. Sindri is full of ideas. <laughs> ah, back to smashing through things for fun and profit. <laughs> Lovely. Mumira, what did you hear of Odin's offer? To the lad? Not much. They stepped outside. He told us about it. I wouldn't worry. What about the things he did not tell us? Remember when we fought our first troll out this way? I remember you lost control. <sighs> we must tread carefully, brother. Danger is close. You okay fighting without a shield? It is not my first time. curiosity against him. It goes with being young. In my youth, we learned obedience. And is that what you wish for him? Brother, he's going to walk his own path. If you don't want him walking away from you, then smarten up and walk with him a while. Hmm. If we could find a way to open room travel to Spartalfall, then there'd be all sorts of useful equipment for us to... Enough. We'll go. Really? But... If we do not find Tyr, you will abandon your search. For good. All right. You won't be sorry. <clears throat> Kratos! Over here! Sindri! As I live and breathe, is that Atreus? It's been so long. How you've grown! <laughs> uh, well, yeah. <clears throat> well, if you'll follow me... Brock mentioned you needed somewhere safe to spend the night, and I believe your favorite dwarves can help you out with that. We're still your favorite dwarves, right? You're still the only dwarves we know. I'll take it. After you, my friends.
Where are we going? The cleanest cabin in all the Nine Realms. And I'd prefer it to stay that way. Not looking at anyone in particular. Kratos. <sighs> After that Thor incident, we thought we should make up some rooms. Till you can figure out your next moves. Nearly there. As you can see, we've settled here in the realm between realms. It's nothing much, but it's safe from Fimble Winter, safe from Odin's eyes. And you really can't beat the view if you're into shimmering gray voids. That's amazing, Sin.